Here's a thought. What causes power outages? And why does it sometimes take a while to get the power back on? There are two types of power outages, planned and unplanned. Planned outages happen when Horizon Power needs to carry out maintenance or repairs to the network to keep it in tip-top condition. When you're looking after the world's largest electricity supply area, you've got a lot of poles and wires spread over a huge distance and battling some tough weather conditions, so there's quite a bit of planning needed. On the upside, at least we get a few days' notice. An email, SMS, phone call or a note in our letterbox telling us when the power will go off and when it's expected to come back on, which means we're able to plan ahead. Then you have the unplanned outages. There's really not much we can do about these. They can be caused by severe weather, vegetation, bushfires, accidents, even animals interfering with power poles or wires. When an outage is reported, Horizon Power's response team is notified and they spring into action. Sometimes they can fix the problem remotely and restore the power pretty quickly. Other times, they may have to send a crew out to inspect the power lines. And with a massive network that covers 2.3 million square kilometers, it can take a while to locate the problem especially during extreme weather when it can be dangerous for the crew. If the power does go out unexpectedly, there's an outage finder on the Horizon Power website. Or better still, if you've got the Horizon Power app on your phone, you can get the latest outage updates. If you'd like to know more about power outages, explore the Horizon Power Energy Hub.